Now you're welcome back once again. My name is Alex Sebahiri and the channel is K2K YouTube channel. Now we are going to walk all around arrays. Yeah, we are going to see the operation that might be performed in array. It means walking around our selector. This is division, subtraction, multiplication, addition, and all and multiplication array arithmetic operations. See when I stop. this see when I try to hit run you see that by default it is start by it is start by division and the output are there if I to make a real time change I will make continuous run and while I am still running I can modify any value in my array and then directly find the output change in my result, see when I try to choose subtraction, you see the um, the output change. It means this will be like a virtual calculator created by created by LabVIEW and will enable me to make all arithmetic operation according to LabVIEW. So the, without a delay, let me create another blank VI and then try to make a graphical code that will enable me just to make my uh, arithmetic operation using using of course lab view see here you create you, you, you create uh, you create and um, you go to matrix and the array pick the array and let's for example use a numeric array come here to numeric then drag and drop there the numeric control make like a three to two matrix and then click control plus to zoom in so that it may be it may fit to the eyes of the operator duplicate this and this will be of course the array you are going to, to walk all around the arithmetic operation of two array. Come here to structure and choose case structure. And we are going to choose the operation to be performed in our uh, virtual instrument using selector. And selector will be found in ring and enum. Then pick mini ring. Okay, click control plus to zoom in to fit the eyes of the operator. Then edit here and call it a selector. Or just select operation. That will prompt the user. To select an operation to be performed on his or her arrays and then this created menu will be used just to select the operation to be performed yeah and by default we will start by case zero come here just to add the to add what will be what will be selected and in order to obtain a desired output, click here, right click, then edit items, and start uh, making the menu. It means this will be just like a menu, for example, that found in the restaurant where you choose uh, the diet which fit your desire. And then here, let's start by addition insert insert another and call it subtraction insert another and then call it for example division Mm 
insert another item and addition subtraction division the remaining one will be multiplication and then i think we are done for all our desired it means you can add more but let stop by here you can do a, a transpose of matrix or just you, you, you do an inverse of matrix but let by this session let stop by here and for for that we mean we for our menu we know that when we select the multiplication of course the array one will be multiplied by the second array then wire up here and then take it here here you add an indicator to, to see which will display the output obtained by the operation performed then create an indicator of course our indicator will be an array of 3 by 2 let me push it down alright it will be 3 by 2 array let me push it down control plus increase the size another that should be visible to the observer okay and rename it to for example result all right i think you are done by the display output it means working all about the interface with our user the remaining will be to continue making the next arithmetic operation which is division let me duplicate this case so that we will edit the operation in the next session duplicate mm, I think we are, we are done and it remains the case one for the case one it is a division come here and then multiply now for the case one it means we start by zero one two and three for the case one will be a division it will be a bit long let's try to replace this by division palette and the next for the case 0 it will be multiplication by default for the case 2 0 1 2 for the case 2 will be subtraction <laughs> replace this palette by subtraction palette for the case Three will be zero one so one two three for the case three will be addition place this by addition palet. I think you are done see when you try to hit the run because there is nothing field in our array you will find nothing else try to edit the item for example it can come nearby 22 if 
33 let me try to clear up 33 for example let's put here for 6 for 7 34 11 and 99 ready to this array suppose that we are given a question on paper and you want to calculate the output you will, you will come and fill this input control by the question you have 23 23 for example 12 23 and let here have 90 see when you try to hit the run the obtained the result will come as multiplication because it is the default selected operation so when you try to select the division and then you will find that the solution will be divided if you want to, to make to take uh, to get a real time result for example as you change the input the output will be changed you come here and then you run continuously so when i try to increase for example here you see that the result will get changed all right i think this program is running away the remaining is just to make a decoration to attract the eyes of the one who will be using my virtual instrument of course this is a virtual array calculator then cover this and then come to view then two palettes and then choose a color of for example green see then close my tool palette select this control shift j to bring up my interfaces and then everything get away see when i try to hit continuous run and try to change see that the obtained output will be there yeah and you can change also the um, the real-time operation if you choose addition for our menu you will find that the array one will be added to the array two. so and then by closing i hope that you enjoyed the video thank you for being a part of k2k youtube channel but you may go deeply by clicking subscribe to my channel leave a comment of how this program or this session of the video gets you may be well or good let me know and to stay in touch make sure make sure you hit subscribe ciao bye